What's going on guys? Twin coming at you with another MLB The Show 19 video. Today we're just trying to stay undefeated with this Battle Royale team. Oopsies, I did not mean to do that. And this team has just a really solid uh, bullpen and lineup. You know, we got a mix of both. Nothing too special on either side, but I do like the lineup. I do like the bullpen, and it's just a well-rounded team. So we're going for 99 or more likes in this video. Subscribe if you guys are new on the road to 28,000 subscribers. Comment anything down below. We're 1-0. Let's go ahead start off this video. Be 2-0. We're playing the West Georgia Grizzlies. Our opponent has Gary Sanchez, 99 Ricky Henderson, 92 Miggy, Francisco Lindor, Scooter Jeanette, Vlad Jr., Trey Mancini, Avisail Garcia, Tyler Cloyd, a righty good for us on the mound. We got Gabriel Moya on the mound. Away team. Looking to stay undefeated. Get win number two. My pitching has been tough recently in Battle Royale. So every game for me here in the, in the foreseeable future is really me trying to focus on on my pitching in battle royale hitting has been fine and i just gotta really i think gear my focus towards pitching and make that my main priority on on, on pitching and improving on pitching i think that's the best way for me to start now trying to get that 12-0 run nelson cruz leading off the top of the second inning Starting pitcher on the mound for our opponent. No doubt home run as we take a one to nothing lead. Let's go. Wow, okay. I'll take it. Uh, I think it's probably going to be considered an air. Yeah, that's an air for our opponent. Chris Davis coming up now, looking to make him pay for the air. Nobody down. One runner on for him here. Top of inning number two. We each had a one, two, three in the first. Um, when I was hitting. I was in the process of uh, battling a bug. There was a bug. I had a fly swatter. I probably should have gone to third there. I think I would have been safe. But I had a fly swatter and everything. And I'm sitting there like swatting at it and then trying to hit. And it just, it was not a good situation for me. Uh, and I think it was distracting me a little bit from doing the best that I possibly could at the plate. Jorge Polanco, deep fly out. Warning track power for him. The foot was kind of on the warning track. So I'm considering it WTP. One down. Runners on the corners. Four. Jed Lowry here, trying to extend our lead a little bit. Top of the second inning, trying to stay undefeated as Jed Lowry. I got to stop talking while hitting. I swing at everything when I do that. I, I, I have found. I found, I found that when I talk and hit at the same time, I'm extremely impatient. Francisco Lindor leading off for our opponent here. Roberto Osuna on the mound. And Francisco Lindor leading off his half of the inning. Oh, Lord, not great, not great. If he goes to third, we got him. He's staying at second, though. I don't blame him. Now, Osuna's mission is to not allow that run. And 0-2 count. We're giving up a hit. Jeez, man. That's the biggest thing with my pitching, too, is 0-2 counts. I seem to, like, struggle a lot. I'm sure it's very frustrating for you guys, knowing that it still happens. I feel like I made a decent pitch. We got it below the zone, but... If I'm doing that, I think I just need to get it below the zone even more. And Vlad, dang. This wasn't a this wasn't an 0-2 count. It was a 2-2 count. Um, I should have thrown it to the cutoff, maybe. But two strike count, giving up another base hit there. Late okay on it. So I'm pretty happy with that. On the inside corner. Had him late. Had to make an okay contact. You know, I'm fine with that. And no, another 0-2 count base hit, dudes. I'm so bad at pitching. Oh my goodness. I feel like the past few videos I've been a broken record. And like, I feel like that's not even a bad pitch. I really don't. Had him early on it. Had okay contact. It's, it's well below the zone, but it's time for me to get Osuna out of here. And... Hopefully get out of this inning with the game tied. I don't want to be in the top of the third. Down to my uh, my final three outs before losing a game. What am I supposed to do? I, I, I really don't get it, man. I don't. Please get him out at home. Thank you. That's big. That's a big out number uh, out number one, right? I think that's out number one. Um... We're down by one. I'm down to my final three outs because uh, we it's pretty much over. <laughs> I don't get it, though, man. Like, he brings in a pinch hitter, pinch runner. What am I supposed to do? Like, 
I don't know. He's stealing. He's going to be on second. Yeah, easily. 99 speed pinch runner. And there's a big out number two. Oh, we got him at home if he goes. Yo, that's going to be two throw. Yo, Nelson Cruz is a god in the outfield, bro. Nelson Cruz keeping me in the game. We're down by one. I'm down in my final three ounce here, okay? This is not a great situation. I'm scared. I really don't want to lose this game, guys. I'm tired of losing early on in drafts, man. He brings in a lefty. Oh, my goodness. Yo, Tyler Austin. Yes, sir. 81 power versus lefties, okay? I got to pause it for a sec, though. I got to take a deep breath. Take a deep breath with me, everybody. Inhale for five seconds. Exhale for five seconds, okay? I feel like five seconds was a little much. But either way, we took a deep breath. We're ready to go. 9-1-2 for us. Pedro Alvarez on deck. He does fine versus lefties. And we got 99 Pudge. Austin Fry, cutter curve, two-seam, four-seam change on the mound for our opponent here. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Scooped up on the backhand. And the old That's a terrible start. And that's not good. That's not good. Oh, Lord. Pedro Alvarez missed it. Down to my final out with his team. 99 Pudge coming up, man. Shoot. Oh, Lord. Not what I was expecting from this game. Is he going to bring in a righty? No, no, no. Okay. So, Pudge, here we go, man. I really want you to tie the game here, dude. I really want you to tie the game. A little bit late on it. That's the game. I'm losing. Oh, dang, man. That sucks. That really sucks. As a lot of you guys have probably noticed, I really try to just be as positive, as happy, as like good vibes type stuff as possible in my videos. I really try to keep the complaining to a minimum just because I don't like giving out negative vibes in my videos. I feel like this is a great place to spread positive vibes and to just be positive, stuff like that. With that being said, the rest of this video is probably going to be the most complaining I've done in a while. I've really just... It's nice to get things off my chest sometimes, and I'm going to use this as an opportun opportunity to do it. Uh, one of the reasons is, and it's definitely not the majority, it's, like, it, it, it's a very small number, it's a minority, but it's more than usual. I've been seeing comments talking about how bad I am at the game, stuff like that. Obviously, I'm not bad at the game. I'm obviously not the best player, but I would say I'm definitely above average. Um... Not to sound overconfident or anything, but I'm, like I'm not that bad at the game, and I've been losing a lot of games in Battle Royale recently, especially early on, and it seems to be situations like this. So we're going to be looking at the hit chance, and 15 is the best hit chance. If you have a 15, that means it's like the best chance for a hit, and then it goes all the way down to 1 being the lowest. So me, I had 2 hits, a 10 and a 15. Uh, we go to our opponents, 2 15s, but then two nines and a 10 and the hit chance isn't really what's the big deal for me here the big deal is it's three pitches out of the zone the pci the middle part of the pci where you want to be hitting the ball can't even reach out of the zone so as a pitcher in a competitive game it's definitely frustrating giving up hits outside of the zone right um especially like that one nine on the corner over there that was the good weak contact. So it's like, okay, my opponent's getting weak contact for a base hit, and I'm squaring up balls, and I'm not getting base hits, and then I'm losing games because of it. And then I feel like I'm playing badly because I lost the game, even though I feel like I actually, in reality, outplayed my opponent but still just took the L in that game. And that's baseball, but again, this is a video game. It's a competitive video game, uh, so it just can be frustrating when... I feel like I outplay my opponent and lost, but it's bound to happen every once in a while. Uh, and then another thing is, too, the outs. So 10, 13, 11, 7, two of them out of the zone, two of them in the zone. And what really kind of bothered me was you guys saw the hits out of the zone, couple nines, a 10, and then we go over to my outs, 15, 15, and then below that 15 in the middle is another 15. I can go ahead and show you guys, too, that that was a 15. Uh, it's from 99 Pudge, by the way, with the 15. You guys see that 15 there, so two 15s for him. Um, so 99 Pudge with the two 15s down the middle, 
for ounce. Then we had another 15, three 14s, 1210, all in the zone and stuff. And it's just like, I feel like I'm playing well. I feel like I'm outplaying my opponents recently in Battle Royale, but I just keep losing games and it's frustrating. I just wanted to address comments uh, and, and just let some steam off of my chest, I guess. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment anything down below, follow on Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, second channel, all that is down in the description. I'm sorry that we're losing this game. Um, nothing you can really do though. We'll bounce back, draft another team. I'm thinking, I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do yet, but I have an idea for a draft, whether it's a themed one or just trying to get a good team, but we'll be drafting a team later. I'll see you guys next time. Follow Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, second channel, all that's in the description. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Peace out.